evening good afternoon uh, respected uh, speakers from manipal fruits uh, from india they have presented about the genetic disorders genome sequencing genomics and also infection uh, how the diagnosis can be done uh, in their uh, hospital uh, here our provai chancellor professor sarfuddin ahmed is present uh, our registrar our uh, ugc professor sajol banerji all the faculties and uh, invited guests ladies and gentlemen uh, on the eve of my speech i will uh, first of all pay my deep respect to our father of the nation bangabandhu sheikh mujibur rahman and all the martyrs of 1975 and all the liberation uh, freedom fighter who sacrificed their life during 1975 i also thank our neighbor india's uh, government during that period they also helped us a lot and they also sacrificed uh, some of the soldiers have sacrificed their life for that uh, liberation war i thank them today they are here uh, some of the colleague from uh, our neighboring countries india they have presented very nicely about the uh, genomics as well as for the infections i think our basic faculties they are very much enriched from this type of uh, presentations i think uh, in all respect all the parts of our body they are related with these types of genomics and who are uh, performing their uh, duties uh, in such a way yesterday or the, the day before yesterday i had one uh, workshop that we will make the curriculum for genetic department medical genetics in uh, future there will be one department in our university which is only go uh, performing by some of the departments but separate departments if we can make medical genetics that will be the best one in future and in this type i asked three questions to our uh, presenter one was there are a lot of patients inborn error of metabolism uh, they suffer a lot what to do many patients from breast cancer they are coming whether it is hereditary and if there is any uh, problem in environmental or our food habits that could be diagnosed earlier then we will be able to prevent this type of uh, uh, cancer breast cancer and other cancers uh, our uh, vice chancellor already told about the fish test it is also going on here but after testing what to do and that for that reason this testing is not only the sufficient one fish test i have already uh, in pathology department when i came uh, as a vice chancellor it was uh, inaugurated also our fit test it is also going on fecal immunofluorescent test uh, that is also going on in uh, colorectal for colorectal uh, carcinoma or other carcinomas already we have heard that not only uh, in ophthalmology in neurology gastroenterology nephrology why there is no the, not the problem today in our uh, our honorable prime minister you will be astonished to know that uh, she had the speech in un and in this event uh, uh, her speech was on anti microbial resistance in our country we have made one rule in uh, our parliament that no one will be able to write uh, antibiotic or steroid without the prescription of a uh, registered medical guardian so we are starting that anti microbial resistance will be prevented in future uh, already in our icu there are lot of uh, resistance grown in future we hope that gene therapy stem cell therapy that will help for the treatment of the patient so uh, we have already lot of uh, research work uh, we, and that research will help all the faculties to prevent the diseases and also to help the people of our country thank you very much manipal trutes uh, for coming here Uh, in our university in future if necessary we will cooperate together as because any blood only 2 mm blood if i send to that place 
what type of investigation not being done here i think the report will help us and together we will work together not only for the treatment not only for the diagnosis it will also work for the research purpose i hope your cooperation will be continued with us and we are in this situation that we will support you with this few words thank you very much for kind attention joy bangla joy bangabandhu long live bangladesh